I said, this has racist connotations. It's equivalent to blackface. He then sends me a picture of him in a tuxedo and he doodles blackface on the person. They can say whatever they want to say. I'm not talking. He is. Every text I have here. Every text. Any word, question you want to ask me, I'm ready to answer. Word Network obviously targets African Americans. Significant number of black preachers who are on the Word Network. Um, I was the I was the face of the Word Network for eight years. I was the I was uh, rejoicing the Word on the Word Network. Uh, the next program I did was called the First Word, which was a program where you brought other preachers on and they could uh, minister and move products. And then my national television program also is on the network. Um, I don't know what got into him that day. Uh, um, this didn't happen in the studio. This happened uh, over texting back and forth over a period of a few days. Uh, when we had our last conversation, I decided to quit. And I was silent about quitting. I left. I was silent. And then bloggers started picking it up that I was fired over the Benny Hinn statement or fired before the misappropriation of funds. I then went on the Larry Reed show in order to get the word out that I was never fired. Bishop Neil Ellis from Global International Ministries called me and said, I've been hearing some things and I read some things online. And I called Kevin Liddell to speak to him. And I'm asking you, Bishop Bloomer, would you go and speak to Kevin Liddell? And I said, no. The only way I'll talk to him is if he puts out a press release stating that he never fired me and there's no misappropriation of funds. He told Bishop Ellis, no, he will not do that. It is not the policy of the Word Network to uh, send out uh, any press release. So I went online and got all the press releases that he had sent out when other people had quit or got fired. He wanted that negative connotation to stay out there with regarding and about me. He then told the newspaper that I, uh, he wanted to change the programming on the, on the network and I wasn't in, uh, in agreement with that. But he forgot the text that I sent him about all of the interviews that I had done with celebrities and movie stars he forgot the text that I have where I built the studio at our church so we can do two shows in North Carolina and two shows in Detroit. He forgot all those things and I have all those texts. So I have texts going as far back as the beginning of the year. My show only aired three times this year, January, May, and September. This guy is a liar. And I want to talk about it. What do you want to happen next? Uh, a letter was put out as well. Um, are you calling on uh, some of the bigger names who have their programming on the Word Network to pull their programming? Uh, and again, for the folks who don't know, uh, these pastors are paying the Word Network to air their services, correct? That's correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And, and you, you, well, and, and, and you were you were you uh, were you paid by the Word Network? Were you, or did you were, were you an employee of them? What was your financial nah, arrangement? Look, I wasn't an employee. I wasn't an employee of the Word Network, but um, I would I, I got free programming for my television programs, okay. and then my books and tapes and so on and so forth like that. I would receive residuals that goes back to my ministry from that. But I wasn't on the payroll. I didn't get a check or. Or anything like that. What has no. been the, what has been the response from other preachers? Have they responded oh, to what you? Oh my God! I, I didn't start the boycott. I didn't. I, I'm glad they started one, but I didn't start the, the 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 boycott. I worked very, 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 very hard to be an honest guy. Um, and that's the truth. And I just can't let him, you know, saw me and and dog me like that. And that 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 was it. Um, at a later date, um, Roland, I'll, I'll 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 share some other things. But I just wanted to uh, clear that um, Jamal Bryant was quite silent on this matter. And um, I called him and I said, 
your silence is uh, questioning me, would make me question um, your activism. And he said, well, he was just hearing some things, he's taking things into consideration and what have you. And he did a show. And uh, it's online. And he got up there and he began to talk. And he shared how that I had quit and I left the word network. But at the end of his statement, he said something that wasn't correct. He said, and after I quit, I went back and I did my final show, which was a lie that never, ever happened. I called Jamal and I said, Jamal, this is not correct. This is not right. Jamal then did a retraction to what had happened. And I said this to Jamal. I said, you didn't make that up. Someone said that to you. So I know that there's a campaign to make things look like it is something that it, that, that it isn't. And um, I, um, you actually.